Hi, it's Weston Nye, and in this video I'm going to tell you why you should stop using TikTok, and why TikTok is dead, and what you should use instead. So I am actually here on a hill near my house trying to beat my record on a downhill section trying to beat it on my bike. But right now we are here to talk about TikTok. So you may or may not have heard about this, but the Chinese social media platform TikTok is being banned in certain countries. Countries like India have banned it and countries like the United States are talking about banning it. Now why do I bring this up? I don't bring this up to be political. I am here to look out for you and your success on social media, and I'm here to give some advice. And that advice is this, stop using TikTok. Now the reason I'm saying this is not to like, just be like, oh, you've like gotten some followers on TikTok and I'm trying to ruin it for you. No, you can do whatever you want. But I'm trying to say, if countries are banning TikTok and the United States is talking about banning TikTok, it doesn't matter where you live, TikTok, unless you live in China, I guess TikTok still probably works there, I don't know. But if you live anywhere other than there, then there's a chance that you're going to lose it all if it gets banned in your country. And so, honestly, that's not a good business decision for you to make if you are trying to use social media as a career. And it's just a waste of time if TikTok as a platform is going to get canceled, basically, and if you can't make any videos and like post any videos on TikTok anymore, but you've grown a huge following because you've worked so hard, it's just gonna be like, oh. And so my advice to you is this, you don't want to waste your time. You want to put your effort into social media, into social media platforms that aren't just gonna get banned. Now, you may or may not have heard about this, but Instagram is rolling out in early August, the new Reels feature, which is supposed to be just like TikTok. And there's a chance, being that it's a new feature, that Instagram algorithms will reward early adopters by letting their Instagram accounts grow. There's actually evidence from other countries where the Instagram reels have already come out, where people are actually saying that their Instagram accounts are blowing up because they're using reels right as it's beginning. They're taking on the uh, new features and so Instagram's rewarding them for that. Now, by all means, if you really like TikTok, keep posting as long as you can. But my advice is not to put a ton of work into it. And if TikTok's your kind of thing, then try posting those things on Instagram Reels. So make sure you keep updating your Instagram app and waiting for that feature because it's gonna be good. And so yeah, sure, upload to TikTok if you feel like it, but just know it might be getting canned soon and it might just be a waste of time. Now, I've had some TikTok accounts in the past. I currently have one at Weston Nye, very original, I know. But I've had many in the past, and I had one account that was my original, just Weston Nye, and I was getting like 20,000 views on some of my videos, hundreds of followers, and I was getting that in hours, like, days and stuff after I even started the account and so it was blowing up that was about a year ago and TikTok was great and it was like letting me get out there the algorithm was really favoring just my silly videos but then I tried again this year and nothing like I got 300 views at most on a video and so it's like I don't know, it seems a little different. Something's changed in the TikTok algorithm. And I was like using all the things, all the tips for like growing and it still wasn't working. And honestly, it doesn't really matter to me now because my Instagram is my biggest social media and it's going pretty good and I'm pretty happy with that. And so I'm gonna keep working on growing that. And so this is awesome that the Instagram Reels feature, which could, blow up my Instagram account way more is now being rolled out. So I would suggest we all get on that and at least give it a try. And yeah, I might still post some videos on TikTok just randomly, but I'm not gonna waste my time. Uh, just gonna not be on it as much and I don't know, probably will get banned. So there's that, I'm not gonna focus on it. You get the message. And now I am going to go get on my bike and we are going to ride down an extremely steep trail at high speeds. 
So my current record is 44 seconds. I want to beat the 44 seconds and uh, top speed so far is 38 miles an hour going down it. And so we'll see if we can beat that too. It's all going to be on the GoPro. So here we go. So I just rode down that hill right there about 40 miles an hour and I got the crown for fastest run down that hill. I ran it in 34 seconds. The previous record was 36 seconds and I just beat that record. So super excited about that. This bike is doing great. Super impressed. And yeah, I'm gonna go home now. Thanks so much for watching. If this video helped you at all, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and tell your friends about this video. Thanks, see you next time.